but this is the wettest I've ever seen celery farm the brush pile is absolutely submerged or floated away Apart from that blue jay and one other peep from a bird somewhere out here, you think the forests were deserted completely, and it may well be almost com completely deserted. These flowers are not being visited by bee or butterfly. I saw only one dragonfly on this whole floating mass in the last 10 minutes. This is a situation with the uh, dam bridge. The east end of these boards have lifted from the, their footing at the ground level and they're, they're floating. And you have to uh, step them very carefully going out there and to push them down to uh, underwater level and and to walk back with them uh, floating up behind your heels the trail coming out of here is Real pretty. We've also uh, heard a nuthatch and seen a couple of grackles. Over toward Jim Wright's house, all full of water. Back over toward the uh, warden's watch over there. It's all lake. We removed these two smaller locust trees from the sidewalk. Adjacent to the Bell House property. This one and this one. On the way walking out here. And now I know why this property was called prime wetland because it's non-different from the stream here the stream just flows right in there it's same level that whole area which belongs to the fell house is now underwater the stream is flowing at a prodigious rate Good thing these larger trees didn't let go. I cleaned up the branch fall down here on the way in. Blocking the sidewalk. <laughs> 